Nate, how'd it go down? When did you find out you were the starter? Um, coaches told me and Tyler last Thursday. So, uh, yeah, we just, coaches asked to keep it internal and, until then. And, yeah, so last did Thursday. You, did you keep it totally internal or did you at least call your parents? Uh, I called my parents, yeah. So How do they receive them? Out. No, they were pretty excited for me, so, yeah. Did the coaches give you something behind Pat? No worries. Uh, <laughs> did the coaches give you a rationale that they say to you, look, this is, this is why we think you're the guy moving forward? Um, yeah, but I mean, I think that's more between uh, the coaches sure. and I and, and the players. And so, yeah, I mean, there's always got to be a reason behind the decision. So, yeah. Did you feel like your camp was solid, though? Otherwise, I mean, did you have, I'm sure everybody has ups and downs. Did you feel like you kind of swam, you know, above the fray a little bit to win the job? Um, you know, Tal and I were really close, I mean, pretty much throughout the whole camp. And, I mean, I don't think there was really a, de a deciding day where it was, where it was uh, one person better than the other, and, I mean, and it was just a decision, the coach's decision. How much will that push you knowing that he is just right there all the time, Tyler, that your performance, knowing that every day you got to be consistent? Oh, I mean, it pushed me super hard every day. Uh, I mean, you know, you got to have the mentality that you're always one play away, and I know that he has that mentality. So, um, I mean, yeah, just continue to try to focus on uh, getting better every day. How does the experience from playing a little bit last year help you as you get into a, a starting role? Um, it definitely helps a lot. I mean, just being a little more comfortable on the field, uh, knowing that this, this won't be my first time on the field. Or, um, so, yeah, I mean, it, it helps a little bit to be more comfortable on the field. Same way with the offensive line in front of you, knowing all the experience you have blocking for you? For sure, for sure, yeah. It's definitely comforting to know that, that all of them have, uh, have a lot of experience and that uh, they'll help me out and help me play a lot better. Was there any parts of your game that you noticed improved during camp? Oh yeah, the decision making got a lot quicker. Uh, um, I mean, Coach O'Keefe really stresses decision making, and then also my footwork they got a lot better. Uh, still got a long ways to go on it, but um, that's like everything. I mean, you can always improve. You talked on media day about being more vocal and, and making strides in that area. Do you feel like you did that this month? Yeah, um, I mean, I feel like I've been a little more vocal, a little more outgoing uh, in the huddle, and. Um, just trying to keep encouraging the teammates and everybody to continue to do their best. What was it like for you when you were in camp last year and you're battling for the number two job? I mean, what were confidence wise? I mean, were you there last year and you, is it, have you grown in that area or have you always been? Um, you know, as you get more experience, I definitely think you get more confident. Um, and uh, being able to be in the number two position last year definitely helped my confidence this year um, but I, I mean the competition was exactly the same I mean I mean same two people um, same circumstances I guess so I mean a competition is a competition and it helps helps get everybody better so. how much did you uh, how much you played behind the guys in the NFL last year how much did playing behind CJ being in the room with CJ help you as far as your development um, it definitely helped a lot uh, learning concepts and uh, overarching themes of the offense and uh, just becoming a, a better football player overall. I mean, uh, I mean, he helped a lot, helps in more aspects than just football. I mean, in life, he's a great guy. So, I mean, every aspect that, that uh, I got to know him through uh, helped me for sure. What ways did Ken O'Keefe maybe change your game or alter what you were doing versus what you were doing before? Uh, I mean, there really wasn't that big of a change. I mean, continue to stress the details just like Coach Davis did. And um, I mean, just just be a leader and get better every day. I mean, same messages from Coach Davis to Coach O'Keefe. What are some of the changes or whether they're subtle or, or conceptual that maybe are going into this offense now versus what maybe was before? Um, I mean, I guess just some, uh, some footwork on some stuff. I mean, just a little bit different, but... Otherwise, uh, game plan and stuff, I guess, just see on Saturdays. Um, man, I'm not going to say anything about that. <laughs> um, yeah. Well done. <laughs> when you Brian went into like the meeting with, with Coach last week when, when he told you guys who was the starter, were you confident when you went in there that you were the starter, or did you not know what the decision was going to be? How did you feel going in there? Uh, I mean, I wasn't, wasn't, too, wasn't too sure about what was going to happen. Um, I mean, like I said, it was a close race the whole camp, so, I mean, you never really know for sure, so nothing's nothing's 100% set in stone, so you never know. How does Tyler handle uh, I mean, we've I mean we've continued to come out to practice and compete, just like we just push each other the same as we did before, and uh, 
I mean, still great friends, and we still talk a lot. So, I mean, nothing's changed, really. On the flip side, what was your first reaction? Uh, I mean, I was very thankful, uh, pretty excited. Um, so, I mean, I guess, like, initial response, he was very excited about the, about the news, and I uh, couldn't wait to call my dad because I know he, he's been uh, – he was waiting for a while to see. So, how did you process the fact that you know last year you went head to head with Tyler and you won that job and earned your red shirt? How did you process the fact that boom, you're back in the competition? Uh, I mean, I mean, I expected it. Did you? Uh, so I mean, it's not like it was a a, a big gap last right. year. So right. I mean, I mean, really wasn't anything uh, mm -hmm. 